We're here at ITU Telecom World 2016 in Bangkok, Thailand. I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Dr. Hiroshi Kumagai, who is the Director General of Resilient ICT Research Center for the National Institute of Information and Communication Technologies, or NICT. Dr. Kumagai, thank you very much for being with us in the studio today. Yeah, thank you very much. Now, I'd like to start off by asking you, how is Japan using ICTs in environmental protection and disaster recovery? Okay, uh, ICT is a very essential element in uh, monitoring, uh, sensing the uh, environment, uh, and it, the data can be used for the protection of the environment. And in the disaster cases, also the uh, monitoring and uh, collecting information is very uh, important. And other than that, uh, the rescue and recovery uh, system is very important for the uh, disaster uh, uh, recovery phases. Uh, we in Japan uh, experienced a very heavy uh, earthquake and the tsunami uh, March 2011. And at that time, uh, we experienced uh, many failure of the uh, communication system and very wider areas, the uh, communication network uh, didn't work well. So at uh, that time, uh, the, the system is not resilient enough for the big uh, disaster. So our lessons uh, learned in that uh, earthquake, uh, we started a uh, new uh, resilient ICT research uh, activities uh, in Sendai. And this uh, event, we demonstrated the two systems of uh, recently we developed for to cope with the uh, disaster recovery system. One is a wireless uh, network uh, ad hoc systems it can be uh, deployed very quickly and very easily a uh, system. The, one, and the other is uh, optical fiber, uh, uh, very quick uh, recovery uh, revi uh, to revive the uh, optical fiber system. Uh, that toolkit, uh, we uh, demonstrated two systems. And the important point is uh, uh, this system are not only used for the uh, disaster uh, cases, but also can be used for the uh, daily uh, uh, regular base uh, systems and uh, particularly the wireless uh, network system is very uh, quickly uh, set up and uh, quickly operated so that can be used for the uh, uh, rural such as the rural areas of Asian countries and to help uh, improve the uh, digital divide issues. So we are working uh, and collaborating uh, in these areas also. I also wanted to ask you, what is NICT's role in delivering a safe and affluent society for all? Okay, uh, NICT has uh, main mission is to develop, the, to do the R&D of new ICT system, but, uh, and also implement this system into the society. Uh, so we are doing, NICT is doing very wide areas of ICT uh, development activities from the very lower layer uh, system development to the uh, application uh, uh, systems. And in this mission, the one is important uh, element is the system uh, used for the, uh, uh, to realize the safe and resilient affluent uh, society. So uh, that is uh, our activities right now and we are demonstrated uh, in this uh, event. How important do you think uh, it is, is it to work with partners in the digital economy? Um, yes, we are very much pleased to uh, work together with partners uh, for uh, this uh, digital economy or uh, digital divide issue uh, to solve it. Um, we are looking for the uh, uh, collaboration and I hope the, uh, our system or our application can help uh, improve the uh, uh, digital divide system, uh, divide issues and also the accelerate the digital economy. 
And finally, we're here at ITU Telecom World 2016, an event that's very important in ITU's calendar. Uh, it's also obviously important to Japan because Japan have got a great pavilion here. So I just wanted to find out for you, what, what is the value of attending events such yeah. as this? Yeah, yes, Japan have been a uh, long time supporting and collaborating the ITU event. And we also uh, cooperate with this uh, uh, exhibition. And we are uh, very much pleased to uh, uh, work with the ITU and to find the uh, potential uh, partners uh, for making a collaboration, in a, uh, uh, especially for solving the uh, social, uh, giving social benefit. Wonderful. Well, thank you very much indeed for being with us in the studio this morning, and we wish you the very best of luck. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Arigatou gozaimasu.